Hi, this is Sally. So I'm making this video to follow up on the previous one, which uh, ended with the question, should we eat carbs at night? Okay, so um, I've just told you about the other side of the argument, why we need to eat carbs at night. And according to this medical doctor, it's because, you know, our body requires energy to detoxify. And so we need to eat carbs at night in order to release energy for us to detoxify. So how do we bridge then the gap between conventional wisdom which says eating carbs at night would just cause you to be fat and you know providing our body with the energy it requires to uh, have a good rest and so you know to detoxify and I think we can bridge these two um, contradictory uh, advice um, by two things actually which relates to time. First is the time of the meal and second the time of sleep. Now let's talk about timing, right? Whenever we eat carbs, um, rice, um, potato, noodles, or just any meal, any full meal, it takes about two hours to digest. So generally, I would suggest that um, in Asia, we tend to have our dinner, we eat rice. But then it's kind of important um, that you know, rice, white rice is actually full of um, sugar and so if possible to take sweet potato instead. Now it's no problem if actually you take your dinner around 6 to 7 p.m. because it takes two hours to digest and so by 9 p.m. it should be digested and just in time for you to sleep at 10 p.m. So you know, a body, your body uh, will not be um, using the energy to digest the food instead of uh, detoxifying the body. But if you have your supper at 11 p.m., then by the time the food digests, it would be uh, 1 a.m. And according to the circadian cycle, your liver starts detoxifying at 11 p.m. So which means that, right, at the point of time when your liver is supposed to be resting, right, um, and detoxifying itself, the energy that would have gone into detoxification went into digesting uh, your supper instead. So, which means that the window period of a detoxification for your liver was missed. So, your liver doesn't detoxify. And so, uh, uh, and, and the liver is of course one of the most important detoxification organs. Now, the second um, point that I want to make is the time of sleep. It's pretty important to sleep actually by 10 p.m. I know we say city life and all that, um, but then if you really care about your health, you should really make the point to sleep by 11 p.m. because uh, the body starts detoxifying at uh, 11 p.m. Uh, let me rephrase myself. You should sleep by 10 p.m. because you know your body just doesn't immediately uh, detoxify. So just to give a bit of leeway. Now, if let's say you have uh, a late night and you're working late and you end up sleeping at 1 a.m. or 2 a.m., um, what it means is that you know certain parts of your organs in your body has not managed to have a good rest. It also means that if you have a late supper, that on top of that, right, uh, it uh, and you sleep at like two a.m. Generally, you know, you have work the next day. Your sleeping hours are actually um, shortened. So instead of the six to eight hours of sleep, you might be looking at four to six hours, which means that the carbs you've eaten, right, it doesn't mean just release the energy and then you know for the rest of the um, sleeping uh, time of sleep, you're detoxifying. Sorry, a bit fumbling there but um, but if let's say uh, you are um, having four to six hours of sleep it means that you don't need as much energy to detoxify so um, at the end of the day people who sleep late or people who do not have enough sleep uh, end up um, getting more uh, getting getting tired or having supper you know late supper, late supper when they sleep getting uh, they get, end up getting more tired because the body doesn't have enough rest um, not only does the energy goes towards digesting the food because they eat too late but because uh, they sleep too late they don't have that number of hours of sleep the energy that should go towards uh, detoxification the body does not need that much now so it goes towards fats so uh, yeah, so just to summarize, the way to bridge it, right, is to have your dinner by 7pm and to sleep early. I hope this helps.